Hello guys, I'm Marco, I'm from Crab Salborn, welcome in Barcelona. Okay, today I'm presenting you a twist on a Bouvelle Bardier. It's called Le Chat Noir and it's our take on a Bouvelle Bardier that we have right now in our menu. We usually age it in a barrel that has been soaked previously in a very powerful chocolate liqueur for a little while. But now we are at the third batch already we put inside the barrel, so it's getting a bit of notes also of the previous batches and giving a line of continuity with the previous batch as well. All right, so to start, we're gonna use rye whiskey. We want to be more kind of dry notes and spiciness of the rye. So we're gonna start with 40 ml of this. Okay, in this case, which is bullet because the high percentage of rye inside. We go up to 95% in the mesh. So 40 ml. After this, we have uh, 30 ml. All right. But 25 ml of the bonnet. Yeah. 30, sorry. And 25 of Campari. So 30 of bonnet, 25 of Campari, 40 ml of rye whiskey. Okay. Also, we want to give a little bit of, and from Italy, so I want to remind a bit of my land. And we wanted to introduce a bit of saltiness, setting salt up in this kind of drinks where there is a lot of bitter notes, okay, so we're using, basically we, uh, we dissolve white truffle salt with water until it's kind of getting saturated and then we use it to balance it up the cocktail and the last touch, just a dash of angostura we add a bit of ice, okay, I like this kind of drink because it's good with different kind of dilution so you can serve it straight up or on the rocks, it always works Okay, Negroni has got the capacity of stand different kind of dilution, all right? My suggestion is to stir it like for 30 seconds, 45. You don't want it over diluting it because we're gonna put it on the rocks in this case. <laughs> Almost ready. We're gonna actually garnish with two different uh, twists. One is orange and one is lemon, okay? Orange is more going on the line of the Dubonette and Campari and lemon bring back the freshness of the rye, okay? And uh, I just like the twist inside and I'm a big fan of the Negroni, I always drink it in Italy when I was younger, so I still carry, I still carry on doing it. Yeah? Hola. Let me try. Sounds great to me. A little bit more. Cut off the sharpness. <laughs> anyway, it's very simple to do, do it in this proportion. And then a little trick is just to dissolve salt with white truffle. It's available in any gourmet shop, it's pretty easy to get. It lasts a long time. And just four drops when it's quite intense, it's gonna help you out. Bring off those flavors. Change the ice, some fresh ones, okay? Just gonna strain it. I'm gonna twist it on top. Spray the glass, give it a nice cut into it, yeah, the eye wants its part as well, <laughs> I think it's a gentleman drink so it should be having a nice garnish, but simple at the same time, cool, and here it is. Enjoy. Yeah.